Hey everybody, this is your girl, Mrs. Toy Banks, the world's most satisfied wife. That's right, I'm satisfied. And today I wanna share with you another reason why I'm so satisfied. Many of you might not know this, but for 11 years, I worked at General Motors. That's right, I worked on the line, y'all. That's right, I was building 500 cars a day. But while I was there, I learned a lot about manufacturing and building a product, which helped me learn a lot about marriage. You know, when I was on the line, uh, just uh, maybe about 10 people down, the car had just came out of the body shop and it was naked. It was had nothing in it. And each person had to add a part. And once it got to your part, you had you needed other people to do their part in order for you to do yours. In order for this line to, to go forward and to move quickly and swiftly, everybody had to put on their part. They had to do their part. If one person missed a part, it would shut the line down. It would have us backed up. It would slow down the process. And the supervisors and the managers would run and figure out what is going on and who, who did not do their part. And so how does that relate to marriage? Well, many people ask this question, Toy, what is the most important ingredient to a successful marriage? Well, here it is. The most important ingredient to a successful marriage is you. I found that out on the line at General Motors. The most important part of the success in a marriage is you. Because see, if any of those people missed out on doing their part, I couldn't do my part. As a matter of fact, it held up the success of building that car. And so the question is, is how successful are you in your marriage? Are you doing your part? Are you doing whatever it takes to serve your spouse? Are you kind? Are you patient? Do you have integrity? Are you trustworthy? Are you forgiving? Are you holding on to past wrongs? Are you as a wife submitting yourself unto your husband as unto the Lord? Are you the husband loving your wife as Christ loved the church? Are you doing your part? Because if you're not, you're holding up the process. We can't move forward. Listen, you could be a great power couple. You can create a great product just out of your marriage if you just do your part. And instead of pointing the fingers at, at your spouse, point the finger at yourself. Examine you and ask yourself, are you doing your part? Are you putting your ingredients in? And, and, and mind you, sometimes you don't need to just ask yourself. You need to ask others. Because sometimes we make ourselves to be so amazing. There are people on the line that used to be, I put that part on, what well, you did? Well, well, it's not there. We, we The part. They claim they put it on. They claim they didn't miss a part. But when it got to me, I couldn't put my part on because they didn't do their part. But they thought they were doing a great job. But we had to step in and say, no, you missed, you, you missed out on that. You, you, you missed your part. And so sometimes you need to go to people who you trust and love you that will tell you the truth. Because sometimes we pat our own back and think that we're doing great and we're not. And someone needs to step in and say, boo-boo, boo-boo, you're not doing your part. You need to be more kind. You need to be more patient. You need to offer peace and seek peace. You need to have integrity. You need to be more trustworthy. You need to be respectful. You need to use your words. You're a little harsh. You're a little nasty. You're a little mean. You're a little short every time you talk to your spouse. Are you doing your part? Are you putting the right parts in and are you educating yourself? Because see, when we joined, when I, when I started working there, they trained us on how to build these cars. They trained us. There was always a person, even if you had to put on a new part, there was someone that came over and trained you on how to put that part on. Have you, are you getting the proper training? Do you understand what it takes to have a successful marriage? Or are you just, going with what you know, which probably might not be enough. You just going with the flow. You just, just going. 
Ask yourself today, are you doing your part? Are you putting the right pieces in your marriage so that you can have a successful marriage? The most important part of your marriage is you. And so you got to check you. For it is written, God says, wipe the smart out of your eye first before you dare try to wipe it out of somebody else's eye. I know I always want to be right. I do. <laughs> I do. I think we all do. We just want to be right. We never want to be wrong. But guess what? I've been wrong several times. I missed the mark. And I need somebody to pull my coattail and say, hey, Toy, you didn't do that so right. And you need to fix that. You need to fix it. So today I hope you check yourself and realize that you are the most important part of your marriage. And you are the ingredient that can cause it to be successful. Well, I hope this helped you out. I'm Mrs. Toy Banks, the world's most satisfied wife in For Better Wife, Better Life, helping you balance it all. God bless.